Just ain't good enough. Just ain't good enough. The new, the new StarCraft theme. You know, da, 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 da. And I get copyrighted for humming the tune. <laughs> Alright, what is up there, you beautiful people? We are back for some more Direct Strike Weekly Brawl. We're gonna play some Carex today. Uh, this week's Brawl is the Double Aura Brawl. So we have Auras here on the staging area, and we have Auras here that we can pick up, as well as Bastions. So the base structures here have twice the amount of HP as they normally would have. So let's just do this, and let's just do that. I don't know, my ally here, I think he's Phoenix, because only Phoenix has that kind of color. There's Manx over here, and then there's Phoenix. Yep, there's Phoenix again. Uh, so Manx is putting down his stuff. Oh, let's see what sort of auras we're getting. Mmm. As I'm playing Carex, I think I want to go Carriers. So <laughs> let's just go tier. Let's just go tier three. Uh, I think I want to go Carriers though, but um, I'm not quite sure exactly what I'm gonna do. Uh, the life is gonna make very little difference on the Carriers. Uh, force is gonna make very little difference. Actually, the force might be the best one because it'll benefit the carriers and it'll also benefit my um, sentinels. Uh, but let's see, what am I against? I am against. I'm against Stukov, I think. This is Stukov, and then this is Mengsk. So Stukov, Mengsk, and then I guess this is uh, Abathur or Kerrigan. Um, so against Stukov, let's just get these sentinels for now. And we'll see where that takes us. Let's see. We'll just put we'll just put him here. Upgrade at the e back. Ula Sadarin. Let's just put them in the back here. Um, let's get them charged with construction. And then I think you know what? I'll go force. I think I'll go force. Help them run a bit faster. Uh, oh baby, we are we are gonna need some sentinels. What's up? All right. Um, I think against Stukov, I can almost contest him entirely on the ground. Because Stukov's air is powerful with his liberators, and I think I don't want to fight those. I think I can beat his air though. I think I can beat his air. So if I go carriers, um, so <laughs> let's just go for it. Let's just go for it. I don't normally play Carrix too much, uh, just because Carrix is really kind of inflexible in terms of like what he has available to him. Like he, he's sort of just like he's got like what he's got this many number of units. And if those units don't make it, then it's going to be a little tough for him. Uh, but honestly, that is fine. Uh, when he's good, he's pretty good. So not is not like a bad thing. Uh, we're going to just sort of make sure we cash in on our... Uh-oh, I'm going to sneeze. Ah! Oh, sorry, guys. Oh. Upgrade. Uh, I got a little sniffles. Uh, I don't know. Is that Corona? Uh, Corona is only like... You know, it only makes you cough, so should be fine, but it's probably something else that I got. Ah, my nose is all congested. Ah, okay, it's kind of rapid recharging. Uh, so that my shield battery gains energy faster. Get that little fortification barrier. Okay, but let's, let's start getting support carriers. Um, what's that? What's happening over here? Let's see. I don't know. Okay, we got that K Darn monolith. What's up? And uh, let's start pushing out support carriers. I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna put them out here. Time to man up. Uh, Hal Vitality, Weapon Range. I don't know where I wanna put them out, let's see. Obliterate. Obliterate. So this one is in Hal Vitality, that's fine. It's got bonus move speed and bonus armor. Uh, any weapon range increase? No weapon range increase. So force was a bait, basically, is what I'm getting from this. Uh, but there's a Kerrigan that I'm running into. And, uh, Kerrigan is going to hard counter me with some mutas. That's the only issue I have against this. Uh, so that car that carrier just went down. I need to have critical mass of carriers though, so that'll help me out. Get that optimized ordinance. I got that enhanced targeting. So that my structures have more range. Oh, my structures have plus one range. So this Kedar monolith has 16 range. So it's actually going to hit any siege tanks that try and get it. But you know, um, actually it won't it won't hit Manx's siege tanks, because Manx's siege tanks have such a big range. Oh, this Adept is going to stand no chance against those Ultralis. Uh, let's get another carrier. We need some more carriers. I think I'm going to need some, uh, I'm going to need some Annihilators as well at some point. Oh, there we go. Kerrigan has all those Mutalists now. That's going to be tough for me to deal with. Uh, at least pushing into that. Uh, but those Mutalists are 
killing themselves on things, so that's fine. Uh, I guess let's get some repair drones so that uh, we help repair my carriers. Oh, he's got some infested diamondbacks, so that'll bring my carriers to the ground. Not that it matters. Question mark. Um, but currently my carriers don't do enough damage. Um, and what does he have? He has plus. Th oh, he has blood. Did he get blood? I need. I need to check that again because his marines have plus three damage. Um, extra damage. That's not like his upgrade damage. So I think it's blood, but I didn't get a proper chance to see. Mm -mm. Let's, let's put down another carrier. Oh, I really need to clean, clean my nose. Oh, okay, Phoenix needs to get some scouts. And so does Manx. Manx got his old Mutalists, but I don't think his Mutalists are as good. Like, Manx Mutalists just aren't as good. They're like... bad Mutalists. Now I have to deal with them. Oh boy. Let's, let's see. Oh, there we go. That's all the nasal congestion. That's gone. Okay, let's just go. Oh no. Does he have blood? He has plus three on his marines, but not plus three on his diamondbacks, which is interesting. Uh, oh, this carrier is getting healed by my shield battery right now. That is very interesting. Okay, so let's just put down another carrier. Uh, I need six carriers before their health really matters. Um, because the mutas will bounce to that many units. Uh, the mirages don't really do too great of a job against them either. Uh, they'll do good enough. But not like. They won't hard counter, that's the thing. Okay, Manx is a little. Oh my god, Manx is little troopers. Manx needs Sky Furies, okay, he has one. Uh, but he needs them at level 3. I mean, level 3 Sky Furies will absolutely destroy these. But yeah. We need, we need some scouts here, Phoenix. Uh, not more legionaries. But that's okay. I guess. Uh huh. Oh boy. Oh boy. Look at that carrier bounce. Oh man. The carriers are completely useless. Uh, so maybe I could just keep my carriers here right now. And then just push forward with sentinels, I guess. Um. The only issue is that... Maybe, uh, maybe I get some Mirages, let's see. Mm, 15 life weapon range. Weapon damage. I think weapon damage here will take it further, because Mirages hit twice. Um, so let's just put it down here. Let's put down some Mirages here. Uh, hopefully that'll help them out. Help me out with the Mutalus. Like, I know I can't beat that, but I'm gonna try it anyways. I will. Let's get that phasing arm going. Okay, Sky Fury is dodging. It's dodging, baby. It's dodging. Look at that dodge. Ooh, it looks kind of ridiculous, honestly, when it's like going around like that. Okay, got that phasing armor. Uh, Mirages are actually beating these Mutalists, uh, which is excellent. But that also means he's probably going to start getting more uh, anti Mirage units, such as more Mutalists. Uh, Okay, my one Mirage here is just hanging out, doing nothing. Uh -huh. Let's get some more Mirages. Um, and then let's get a Observer. I'm gonna put it like right over here, maybe. I don't know if it's gonna die to the bounce. I don't think it bounces to things it can't see, so I should it should be fine. Uh, and then we'll have some more Carriers. Uh, here we go. Yep. Okay, Manx Mutalus. Don't stand a chance. Uh, Manx Rocket Troopers also don't stand a chance. Sky Fury? Maybe. So it seems like... I think he needs Black Hammer. He needs a Black Hammer. This is those moves. Yeah, you definitely need Black Hammer. Uh, Black Hammer will annihilate Mutas. Uh, so all of my Mirages just died. Uh, because Mutalists are quite strong. And I don't really have a good answer to these Mutalists either. So I need my Manx ally to take care of these Mutalists for me. Um, I like cannot deal with them at all. My carriers go down really fast. So do my Mirages. And I have not. I, I, this is why I don't like playing carriers, guys. You you face Kerrigan and then you're just like, uh, yes, I cannot do anything. Um, yup. And then, okay, so he's got a Pride of August grab right now. Uh, enemy Manx. Okay. Those Rocket Troopers easily just take that down, hands down. 
Um, but yeah, I need, I need my ally to get a black hammer. Like, like, please get a black hammer. I cannot handle those meterless. He got another sky fury. He got another sky fury, guys. He got another sky fury. I, I like, I like, I cannot deal like with these meterless. Like, look at them. They destroy my, my mirages like it's nothing, and then they go and hit my carriers like it's nothing. I mean, right now they're doing good because they're on top. Oh yeah, he has plus two upgrades on those. Yes, I'm slacking on air upgrades. Let's get some air upgrades then. <clears throat> Man, my nose is still a little clogged. It's kind of, it really kind of sucks. <clears throat> okay, that's the Yamato coming out. Uh, let's see. Can my carriers do damage to this thing? No. Well, I guess there's no chance for that to happen. It just fell apart. Uh, support carriers, and now here we go, we're getting annihilated. Uh, Phoenix. My support carriers. Just going down. Bam. The Sky Fear is doing their best. There's this one little Dominion Trooper over here. He's being ignored. Uh oh, he's gonna die. He's gonna die. Watch. There we go, he's dead. <laughs> he just got bombarded. Okay, let's just, let's just get some more air weapon upgrades and stuff so that I can hopefully annihilate these Mutalists faster. Uh, and then let's just drop a beam here. Let's just drop a beam here to annihilate the wave, that so that we don't lose any tempo. Uh, okay, that could have been worse. Uh, let's get some more carriers. Let's see, carriers. We got seven damage on the interceptors. Uh, we got a lot of damage on these ion cannons, but they're just not good enough, I think. Um, just ain't good enough. Let's see. Just ain't good enough. Just ain't good enough. The new, the new StarCraft theme. And I get copyrighted for humming the tune. <laughs> Can you imagine that? Um, okay, he has Black Hammer here. Um, he needs. He needs to auto siege. Um, Black Hammer. Uh, so Black Hammer did seem to help out though. Uh, even if he got disrupted. Because Black Hammer is good against August Red as well. He's good against because he just shoots really fast. Um, I know Black Hammer like doesn't do much damage per shot, but it's not it's not the worst thing out there. That's the thing. Uh, so all these defensive structures are just getting mauled. Uh, my support carriers have just almost all but died off. But that just means I probably need more support carriers. I probably need some more sentinels on the ground to be honest. Uh, these guys have a lot of kills. What the heck? Okay, let's see. Uh, there we go. Medivac's invisible. Yep, that is that is true. Uh, okay, he has a lot of circles now. He's trying to rush the ground as well as the air. Uh, Black Hammer is getting just surrounded by those zerglings. Oh my goodness. Black Hammer needs a, needs a personal escort. Uh, I mean, as long as they're fighting on top of our bunker, the Meatless won't, won't survive for long. The only issue is that, well... Uh, actually, I, can, I, think, I think I can deal with the Karax wave that follows pretty nicely. Uh, can I? Let's see, our bunker is taking some hits. But um, our carriers are mopping this up quite nicely, so yeah, I think I can. Uh, let's see, I can put a carrier here. I can put a carrier here. Let's do that. And then let's put that here. Not enough. Let's put down another mirage. I think our air force is looking up, looking uh, shaping up real nice. Uh, let's get a graviton beam. Maybe. Uh, can't my carriers contest the August grad? Uh oh. Forget the August grad. Can they contest this? Okay, so Phoenix's ground little blast thing definitely helped me contest that. Uh, but the August grad is. I'm not being. I'm not able to deal with the August grad properly. It seems. Um, I might get shadow cannons actually, so I can knock those out of the air. Um, not the best choice, uh, but it is a choice nonetheless. And then here with the shadow cannon, it's going to have some cooldown reduction as well. Um, so hopefully that'll help us out. You have some extra range with the uh, force upgrade as well. Let's get some air armor. So air armor, I think, will be very important to keeping them alive against all these marines. Uh huh. Air armor. Let's see. We have six air armor. These marines do like. Oh man, he has they do plus twelve damage. Field assist targeting. Oh man, AOE on the uh, AOE. 
Double AoE on the August Grad, just obliterating everything. This is why. August Grad needs to be heroic, guys. Because as soon as he, he has a level 3 August Grad, and he gets another August Grad, and he gets another August Grad, and he gets another August Grad. You know, you know the deal what happens. Uh, Black Hammer, is he deploying his Black Hammers? Um, he is not deploying his Black Hammers. Um, let's see. Deploying your Black Hammers to Overwatch mode to annihilate, annihilate air. Yeah, guys, Black Hammer can annihilate air in Overwatch mode. If you have not seen it in action, I don't know if we're going to see it in action in this video. Uh, I do have a video where I showcase that, so I'll just sort of pop that up right here in the card, right over here, if you guys want to see it. Um, Black Hammer does do decent DPS. Um, one, my one Black Hammer, I think, soloed a Hyperion by himself. Obviously, he wasn't tanking a Hyperion, but uh, he was he was blasting away at the Hyperion while a Hyperion was trying to get through the enemy, get through our wave. Um, so, Black Hammer is no joke um, for anti-air. You just gotta know how to use him properly. His Overwatch mode is kind of buggy, uh, and so it doesn't always work. Um, but I think my, my ally is just like saying, "Screw it, we're just gonna, we're just gonna walk him around in, in normal, normal like anti-air form." I mean, they do do damage. Uh, oh, he was in Overwatch mode, um, and I think he stopped being in Overwatch mode. That's interesting. Uh, what is this area? Was that Overwatch mode? I think so. I think so. But it looked like it was buggy. He's got some air weapons. That's a lot of Brood Lords coming forward to get destroyed. Uh, that's, let's just beam this wave. Let's just beam it. Let's beam it. Roast everything. Soon it will all be clean. Soon it will all be clean. Look at those Sky Theories. Everything. Roast them all. Boom. Carrier Swarm. Uh oh. Somebody's lagging. And it's not me because I can move my camera around. That's a big tell. Uh, Space Raven. Okay. Someone else on the... Uh, oh, it's the Manx Gunnar team. Okay. I just realized it's 17 minutes and I still don't have my fourth gas. So I'm going to get that. Um, not rage quit, just lagging, my guy, just lagging. Uh, but if Manx leaves, I don't know if I will be able to properly deal with this anti-air properly. Um, because all I'll have left are Phoenix Scouts. Uh, well, actually, Phoenix Scouts do AoE, so not, not that bad. If they could help us out. Um, uh, but unfortunately, if Space Raven doesn't make it back in time, I think we're gonna have to give him the boot, because we need to move on with this video. Um, let's do it. We got 14 seconds remaining. Ah, my nose is still clogged. I'm gonna have to blow my nose like afterwards, guys. This is this is, this is very uncomfortable. Uh, can you heal us? Heal two targets at once. Uh, they used to be able to, but not anymore. Just drop them. Drop. There we go. Unfortunate, but we're gonna have to drop them. That just vaporized all of my mirages, I think. Oh my god. And that just vaporized all of my peers. Oh my goodness. Those August grads are so strong. Um, I'm gonna get the Shadow Cannon. Maybe Shadow Cannon can help me take on that August grad. Uh, but it looks like it shot a Kerrigan instead. Um, that is a lot of Zerglings. That's just leaked through. Uh, when a teammate lags an SC2, drop it like hot. Yeah, basically. Oh my god. I did not deal with those Zerglings at all. Jesus, those are going to just rip through our defenses like it was nothing. Uh, and there goes our... Okay, so you know what? I think I need more I need more Sentinels, guys. I need to be able to catch that wave on the bottom, like on the ground. Uh, let's go. I'm going to put my Kedar Monolith in the back. While I can still have access to it. Uh-huh. But also the beginning of the end, even though we're spawning more often, I think I'm less able to deal with this. Like, I think my guys are able to deal with the Stugov wave decently, but definitely not the Kerrigan wave, and definitely not the Manx wave, it seems. Uh, ooh. Our Manx was definitely doing work, but honestly, like, the video has to go forward, and we're gonna have to drop him. Unfortunate. Uh, like, this this one August grad is so strong. Like, I'm telling you, like, August grad needs to be heroic. Uh, like, heroic, unique, we can only build one. Um, so he's got a black hammer now, he's got a black hammer me. Uh, oh my goodness, that's all, that's the base getting chopped down by those Zerglings, I think. I don't have anything on the ground to defend my Where's base. Oh, we're getting chopped down. This is it. That's the game, guys. That is the game, guys. Oh. So, 
Uh, unfortunate matchup. I mashed up into Kerrigan, but this is why I don't like playing Kerrigan as much, and this is why Kerrigan is usually, I consider him a lot weaker. Um, simply because he just, get, he just gets straight up hard countered by Kerrigan <laughs> or Abathur with Mutalisk. Um, and it looks like Manx is doing a pretty good job too. Like anyone who bat who can counter his carriers will just hands down destroy him. So if you guys like that video, consider leaving a like. If you guys enjoyed that kind of content, enjoyed direct strike, and you're new here, consider dropping a sub. But until next time, I will see you guys later.